Hello, this is Jerry Kerr. Uh, this is the Worship Confessional for November 2nd. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is the Crosspoint Worship Confessional for November 2nd, 2008. And it was a great day at Crosspoint. We had a couple guest musicians filling in on bass and keys. First off, on bass, we had Josh Summers, who is a friend of Phillips and played at Great Escape uh, a couple years ago. Or Mace, I think he still plays there, maybe. I'm not sure. Um, but he came in, filled in for us last minute, did a great job. And Stephen Adams, who played keys for us, has played for us a couple times, both in our Sunday morning and Crosspoint services. Uh, Stephen recently got married. Congratulations, Stephen. And um, he filled in with us. Stephen plays with the South First Band, that is a Texas country band that plays around Texas. Um, it was great uh, to have Stephen with us today. He did a great job. Um, we opened with Let the Praises Ring by Lincoln Brewster and basically opened it with jungle drums, um, hit the big note at the beginning, and came straight into it full. Philip did a great job on the Brewster lead again, uh, the Irish jig kind of thing. Um, did a fantastic job. People really enjoyed it, clapping along the whole time. Uh, good, good run through of Let the Praises Ring. After Let the Praises Ring, we had a break, and there was a presentation from uh, Kids for Christ with Joe Anderson. They're from Dallas. It's a mission opportunity for our college kids that they have every year. Um, they did a great job, brought some kids with them. Um, really good, exciting opportunity for the, uh, the college folks. After the break, we came into Our God Above, and that's by Andy Melvin out of Austin and uh, went really, really well. We did a loop intro. Um, I did some kick and rim stuff with sticks. Went really cool. Um, and Josh over that did shaker, wood block, and tambourine. And it felt really good. And came into the song, went through to the bridge, and in the bridge we dropped it all the way out and then came back in with a halftime feel and then built it back to common time. Went really well. Um, the, the people really enjoyed this particular song. Todd taught it last semester, and we've done it a couple times since then, and it works really, really well. After Our God Above, we transitioned into Vineyard's You So Love the World, and it's off of the Dwell record, which is a great record. Um, again, with this one, we transitioned using drums and percussion, did set up some uh, a loop again for this one, and uh, standard arrangement for this. We didn't do the funky time signature or uh, odd time signature at the end, uh, just kept it pretty normal and crashed out. Uh, good run through of that one. After You So Love the World, we went into the Shane's The Answer and transitioned with keys. The, the transition uh, got a little screwy. Steven, Steven messed up just a little bit. It wasn't a big deal. Um, he caught what was going on and, and fixed it really quick. 
um, but we got into it pretty quick using keys as the transition, and uh, I think this may be the first time that we've done this song, but uh, had Katie Van Dunk take us into the song singing uh, as Philip switched over to acoustic guitar, and uh, went really well. Uh, good run through of that song, um, had some nice groove to it thanks to Josh, and uh, went really well. After the answer, we came into, uh, well, we were going to transition with keys, but we didn't end up doing it with keys. We just did a cold stop and then went into uh, Third Days, My Hope Is You, um, an old school song. We've never done it in Crosspoint. I actually have never played the song, um, but it went well. It was kind of a last minute deal. Ryan was talking to us before the service and just kind of mentioned it, and I was like, oh, that meant, that song is awesome. And we, we ended up doing it. We kind of tweaked the chords right ahead. We did it in B, and it uh, felt really good. crowd enjoyed it. We actually ended up bringing it back up for another full chorus at the end. Uh, we did some real cool guitar work over the, uh, the verses, or actually over the, the instrumental sections. Um, sounded really cool. Very cool rendition of the song. I'm sure we will bring it back again. Close out cross point was a really good service. Songs felt really good. It was nice to have some guest musicians. They did a fantastic job. Uh, Steven, as always, and Josh was a uh, was a pleasure to play with. And I guess we'll come back and do it again next week. And we will see you guys then. Bye.